Yo, what's up guys, welcome back to a brand new Roblox Studio video. My name is Floppy and today guys, I'm going to be showing you how to make a working clock inside your Roblox game. So the first thing that we're going to want to do is make sure Explore and Properties are open. If Explore and Properties are not open, all you want to do is go to the top bar here, click on View and click down on Explorer and Properties. Now that we have got Explore and Properties open, we want to head over to Server, Script, Service. We want to click the plus button and insert a script. Now what you're going to want to do, you want to head down to the description and copy the first script that is in the description. Copy that and you want to bring it back to Roblox Studio and we want to remove all the previous script. So just go backspace, delete it all and then we just go control V to insert the new script. Once you have inserted the script, you can go up here and change this to your own custom time. The higher the number, the faster the time will go. The lower the number, the slower the time will go. Now that we've inserted the first script, we want to head back to the base plate. So just by going back to the base plate by clicking here. Now we want to head back to over to Explorer and find Starter GUI. We want, then want to click the plus button next to Starter GUI. Click on Screen GUI. And then we want to go to Screen GUI and insert a text label. Now that we have got our text label, we want to go and customize our text label. So you can change the position you can change the color. It is really up to you. Just have a bit of a look around in the properties of the text label. You can adjust whatever you would like. But for this tutorial, all I'm going to be adjusting is the position. So it is kind of in center of the screen. And I'm just going to be adjusting the text. So to make the text more, more bold and not so small like up here, all you want to do, you just want to head down to the text here and click on text scale. And as you guys can see, that is made the text scale to the size of the text label. Now that we have customized our text label, we want to head back over to the text label and click the plus button next to text label. Then we want to insert a local script. Now you want to head back down to the description of this video and find the second script. And all you want to do is copy that second script, bring it back to studio, remove all the previous script in the local script and paste the new script. Now that we have inserted all the scripts that are needed, we want to head back to the base plate and we want to go test the game out. So you can easily test the game out in Roblox Studio by going to the base plate and clicking on play. As you guys can see, the clock is working and it is currently 12 p.m. in the afternoon. And by the time it gets to about six o'clock, you will start to notice the sun going down. As you can see, the sun is currently just right above us, meaning it is about midday. So once this reaches about 6 p.m. in the evening, the sun will start to head down and the moon will start to rise. Just to make sure everything's working, I've just gone and quickly adjusted the script to 0.01. .01 and we're going to test to make sure that the sun does go down and the moon does come up once it reaches about 6 p.m. Let's go test it out. If you guys are a little bit lost or you don't really know what to do and you need some help, feel free to send me a message on Discord and I'll happily help you out. But anyway guys, I'm going to wrap up the video here. If you did enjoy, I'd appreciate it if you do consider liking the video and subscribing to the channel. I'd really, really appreciate it. But anyway guys, have a lovely rest of your day and I'll see you guys all in the next video. Peace.